Hey Ravens, I'm here at the New Olathe Public Library and I'm here to take you around and show you all the wonderful things that this library offers. Opening was April 29th of this year, so we've only been open for a couple of months at this point. I don't know the exact reason why they wanted it here. It is close to, it's in downtown, it's still close to where we were, it's easy for people to find being right off of Santa Fe, we're close to City Hall, um, and they the design of this library was really because they wanted us to be a beacon in the city skyline. Um, so if you see us at night, you can see like the lights from the building, you can see us pretty far away. I think it's been a really great location for us. We get a lot of people in, very excited to see the space, and I think staff and customers both love it here. Personally, I've just seen some growth just from the interactions that I've had with different customers. Um, there are just a wide variety of things that can happen at a library. I think I've also just learned more about the community as well. Like all libraries offer relatively the same things, and we do share a lot of the same resources, but I think our location is really key here because we do serve um, lots of school age kids being very nestled in between a couple of high schools and middle schools, um, and just like the population of people we get here at this building is pretty unique. It's also one of the last places where people from all walks of life uh, gather together in the same place like you see um, poor people, rich people, young, old, uh, everyone comes to the public library. It's just there's so much you can do at your library I feel like people don't realize that but lots of free it's all free. The Olathe Public Library has much more to offer than just books. We have our teen zone here um, so that is for anyone sixth grade through twelfth grade um, and that is a space just meant for them. So it has the gaming consoles, so a Switch, Xbox, and PlayStation, as well as an Oculus. And I think our Flexbox is also a pretty unique feature with the bleachers that come all the way out. Um, for people, they can have bleacher type seating instead of just tables and chairs. They're one of the last remaining places where people can come for free and just spend time. We offer free resources um, for everyone, not just teens or people in high school, but like anyone in the community. Um, I think we are one of those last few places to offer things for free like you don't have to give us anything to come and be in our space if you're at all interested in checking out this library it's going to be on santa fe and chestnut for ownb now this has been nick woodworth now back to the desk